Good morning, my dear friend. It is a Tuesday morning, a bit brisk out today, but we're thankful, isn't it? And we are looking at Psalm 9 today, and it's a psalm of David really declaring the wondrous things that the Lord has done. In verse 1, it says this, To the choir master, according to the Muthleben, a psalm of David, I will give thanks to the Lord with my whole heart. I will recount all your wonderful deeds. I will be glad and exult in you. I will sing praise to your name, O Most High. When my enemies turn back, they stumble and perish before your presence. For you have maintained my just cause. You have sat on the throne giving righteous judgment. Verse 5. You have rebuked the nations. The Lord has rebuked the nations. In other words, he's the one that pronounces judgment. He's the one that pronounces what is right. And what is wrong? A lot of times we want to take this on ourselves. We want to talk about things. We want to make broad proclamations. But we need to rely on his dependence. It's he who rebukes. He who rebukes. So let's go to the Lord in prayer today. Just say, Lord, we want to get out of the way. We want to allow you to do what you do. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we come to you today thankful. Lord, this scripture said, it's you who rebukes the nations. Lord, we want to learn really just to keep our mouth shut, to allow you to do what you do. Our hope, our trust is in you this day, in Jesus' name. Amen.